Do you want to hear it? Yeah. Awesome. Very cool. What was this? Well, US 99.5 has been pretty good about playing this song. So <laughs> if you want to like call it and request it every day, though, that would be awesome. Underneath. You're really annoying. <laughs> and, like, call them. Have you have their number on your speed dial? <laughs> and call them every day. You'll be like, hey, I know you just played that 10 minutes ago, but I'd really like to hear it again. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, this is a song that I wrote about a guy who um, went to school with me, and I was that friend, you know, mm -hmm. that girl who's your friend, mm -hmm. uh, and you know, he had this awesome girlfriend mm -hmm. who he would tell me about every single day, and uh, you know, I, I was that girl that he would go to and be like, what should I get her for Valentine's Day? I have to, <laughs> <laughs> I have to make this Valentine's Day so awesome. It's her birthday. What should I do? What would the perfect gift for a girl be? And of course, I'd give him like the most awesome ideas, awesome plans, like how I would want them. Mm. And uh, you know, it didn't end up like in the end of like the chick flick where they, they get together in the end. It didn't happen like that. So <laughs> I wrote a song and put it out on the radio, and they're still together. <laughs> oh. Did they know that it's not him? Oh yeah, definitely. I think um, I think right under his driver's license where it says Drew Hardwick, it says. Taylor wrote a song about me. <laughs> um, but I haven't talked to him in a while. I haven't talked to him for like probably a year and a half. But I've heard through the grapevine that he's very well aware of it. But oh. but you know, it's crazy how having a top five hit with a song won't get you over somebody. <laughs> but uh, this one's called Teardrops on My Guitar. I bet she's beautiful, that girl who talks about And she's got 